Box office receipts were down for the 11th week in a row, but one young man sure to help boost ticket sales soon is Harry Potter. In the latest installment of the series, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, the young wizard faces death, jealousy, and for the first time ever, love. Patrick Stinson's got the scoop. This year, Hogwarts will play host to a legendary event. The Triwizard Tournament! Harry, Hermione, and Ron have returned for their darkest saga yet. Ron in this one, he's um, a lot more sort of like a real sort of teenage. He's a lot more moody in this one. For the first time, um, Harry and Ron have a really big um, fallout. Eternal glory awaits the student who wins the tournament. This one's going to be a bit more sort of heavy going because like, obviously there's a couple of deaths. Harry! Death? Drama and danger set the stage for the fourth installment of the Potter series, but it's not all bad news for the young wizards. There are celebrations, a big dance scene, and perhaps even love. Just being totally swept off her feet, she doesn't really understand what's happening to her. So who's Hermione's lucky guy? Star Quidditch player Victor Crump. He takes out the old ball. And... A little bit of fun dancing around. The dress they put me in is absolutely beautiful. We've never sort of seen Hermione look like that before. The cast not only perfected the waltz, they also mastered scuba diving. I really enjoy doing all the underwater stuff because um, I, I, I loved scuba diving before I did before I did the film. Um, I already had my pay certificate and all that sort of stuff, so that was great. Dark and difficult times I had, Harry. Soon we must all face the choice between what's right. What is easy. The film also has a brand new director, Mike Newell. He directed Four Weddings and a Funeral. Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire hits theaters November 18th.